Howdy gamers, and welcome back to the Hardcore Iron Man. Wow, we're in a familiar site. I feel like I've started, like, three videos now in this exact spot. Uh, pretty much in this exact year, and you know what that means. It's because we have another gorilla task, as usual. Uh, this task is going to be put me, putting me over 1,200 kills, which is the average for all four. So this is the deciding task. If I do not get it, if I don't get the last Zenite right here, I am officially dry. So... I'm really hoping we can get it. Um, this task is going to bring me up to 1,270. We have 183. It's a really beefy task. We're going to try my luck. That would be a great way to start the episode. Finishing up the Zenites. 84 ranged. And 1975 total. We're getting, you know, the next total milestone. We'll be hitting 2,000. And I'll finally have a little bit more worlds to choose from. Still going strong here at the U trees. 85 woodcutting. I definitely have more U logs than I'll need for my fletching goal. But I'll probably stick it out, stay here for maybe one more level, uh, and that should be enough to at least, like, realistically stew boost up to Redwoods if I need the log for Guardians of the Rift in the future. Another round of clues from the woodcutting. Medium. Ooh, new collection lock. Mithril plate body trimmed. And the hard clue. Ooh, yes! Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> That's such a good drop! Dude, I have Zavi Chaps. Oh my god, dude, that's such a good, what a great way to start the day, man. <laughs> this is great too, because I, uh, you know, I didn't end up getting the Ranger Boots when I went for them. And these are better than Ranger Boots until you get pick Asians anyway, so. Yay! 1,205 Demonic Gorillas logged on the Gravestone. That means we are officially at the drop rate for four Zenites. And this point on, I am considered dry. I'm not really complaining because it's not that big of a deal right now, but we did not beat the average. I haven't seen a gorilla drop in a long time. We just got a ballista spring, which is kind of annoying because I now have three. I still need other ones. Like I, I wouldn't mind the collection log. Just stop giving me the lit the, the spring, bro. <laughs> Give me something new. Oh shit! Th this no, I I this could be it, guys. I. Oh, no. Um, okay, so I was just streaming Gorillas, and my PC just shut off. Uh, I don't... I think my, like, C... I don't know what just happened. It, it just, like, four shut off, black screen, and then went back on. I didn't press anything. So it just, like, force reset. This could be it. I was in the middle of a demonic kill. Oh, no, okay. Oh, fuck, dude. Ah, all right, here we go. I'm gonna look immediately at the symbol, guys. Oh, <gasps> no way. Oh, it happened again. I ring a life at seven. It happened the same way. I was at seven last time. What the fuck? Dude? <laughs> yes, we're alive. Oh my God. This game mode is going to cause another heart attack. <laughs> oh, he's alive. Look at that. The, the ring of life. That's why you use ring of life, guys. I've had people tell me, just, you don't need to use Ring of Life. Use a Zerker Ring, blah, blah, blah. I would have not even had an account, bro. Dude, that scared me. We got a collection log pop-up, a list of limbs. Dude, me complaining earlier actually worked. Yes. All right. I suppose one step closer to being a green log. I doubt we're going to be able to get that, but we still need, like, the monkey tail and the heavy frame, which are really rare. There it is. The last kill. Ah, oh, it was a brew. Oh, unfortunate. Task done. Another, that was another beefy one. 183, no cigar. But, you know, thankfully I didn't DC again. My computer seems good. I, I think the crash, it, it could just be a fluke. I don't really know. I, I'm still hoping it's a fluke. I don't want it to happen again. But at least we get a nice reprieve from these guys for a bit. It's going to be worms. We skip them into black demons. <laughs> uh, cancel because I don't do worms. <laughs> Flag demons? Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. So close, bro. <laughs> I almost became a fortune teller. Bro, rip all my Slayer points. There's worms again. <laughs> it's just, I don't want to do them without, like, a better weapon than a decent. That's the thing. They're not a bad task. Anyway. Gargoyles. Yeah, we'll take that. Well, I guess we have to go back. It's a very common message that I get from Steve over here. Another black demon task. I'm never going to get the whip, am I? But anyway, I did just finish a medium clue because we had a Dagonos. He gets so many seeds from this task. Anyway, can we get anything? 
Ooh, Armidal Miter. I think I already have a Miter in the bank. I think you need one for an Elite Clue, but it's, it's on the collection lock. I, I literally knew it was coming, and I still missed it. 95 strength. Beautiful, man. Such a high level for where I am right now. Got a clue scroll from the Gorillas. I don't think it's going to top the last one. Oh, look at them. But uh, who knows? We're still looking for a blessed dehyde body. I mean, now that we have the Ceridoman ones, I would like to see Armidal body. That would be beautiful. Ceridoman page. All right, we'll take it. Hey, I didn't even get the message because I immediately got PJ'd by this guy. Thanks, man. 80 Slayer. That is, I'd say until 85, the best Slayer level right now. Because that is Neck Reels. Forgot that I had this uh, Brimstone key in the bank. Let's open it up. Gonna get something so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, yeah. What? One rune play? Like, hey, 90 HP. What a clean level, man. Hello, hello. We got another hard clue. You know, we're not getting any drops here, but we are finishing hard clues, which is kind of a rare sight. Just a money pit. Well, it happened, guys. Yet another task done. This has been two straight days of gorillas. Uh, I did the entirety of the task yesterday and then this entire task today. So in like 36 hours, I've done like 300 demonics. Oh, and I'm not even burnt. I'm I'm still down to do some. The problem that I mentioned earlier is that I'm literally out. Okay, we're not actually out. Surprising. We have 800 charges. But the problem is if I get another task, that's not enough. I'd run out halfway. So I am I am begging the universe to just not give me black demons just for a little bit. Give me dust devils. Give me black, uh, you know, um, blood velds. Give me some ancient shards so we can recoup a little bit. I really don't want to do off task shard grinding again that I've already done extensive amounts um anyway I guess I probably should show it uh yeah nothing changed this entire lock has not changed this task 1405 the KC is getting up there what is my luck with getting a new task on the first time you can get it let's fucking go man neck reels dude yes that, that makes up for not getting any dust devils really what a treat, man. And that's Ancient Shard City right there. You have superiors. Oh, no, I didn't extend them. No. What a blunder. <laughs> um, Yeah, that it's a burst task. You really want to extend them. All right, here we go. Well, we have it now. That's unfortunate. Could have been a lot more, but we will be using Slaughter Bracelets. So 132 will probably turn into about a 180. Still going to get a nice taste of the task. Hey, that kind of spooked me. I'm like, why am I getting a collection log? I don't have a superior. Rune boots. Um, I think it was this video. I, I, I don't know. My, my clips are kind of blurring together. But I had to recently drop a hard clue that required hard, uh, rune boots. But now I don't have to in the future. Very nice. Glad to get it done on the first task. So it's just not a bother. Look at them. The first greater Necreal. Or not Necrearch. I mean, sorry. I called them by the wrong name. All right, so my plan for this, I know there's a way you can like avoid the minions, but we're just gonna we're gonna tag all the neck reels so we have them. Uh, may as well tag the big one too, so he doesn't despawn. And then we're going to lure them all together, and then we're going to blood barrage for most of it, and that should keep me alive. But I think this should be fine, because this is what I used to do back in the day. So yeah, those are the big minions. That's what does a lot of damage. So I'm just going to be doing Blood Burst. Not Blood Barrage, my bad. Blood Burst should keep me sustained while killing this guy. It'll be a little expensive, but it gets the job done. Or not. I am low HP. What happened? Oh my god. Uh, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't. Okay, let's not do that again. Yeah, so this is kind of annoying. But I, I, I guess eventually, once I get Blood Barrage, we can just be fine. I'll have definitely enough healing. Um, otherwise, yeah, once I get a Trident, I can just... Stand over here and try to them. It'll be better DPS. But first Necriarch is a normal drop. We did get a clue, though. What a day. I think I've done three hard clues today. That never happens. I haven't had to drop any. I saw noise. All right. What are we getting? God damn it. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Task over. 40,000 Slayer. You know, compare that to, like, an extended Blood Valve. It's about the same. Um, maybe more because neck reels, I didn't get an extended value, but the thing is you finish the task so fast. It's like dust devils. They're very fast, very good slayer power, and this is what I need. I need the boost to the XP because I 
really need these slayer levels. Dude, the luck has turned so quickly. Finally! You know what you guys don't understand? Okay, you probably do because I've probably mentioned it a thousand times by now. This is only my second Dust Devil at 80 Slayer. Dude, this is the greatest day of my life. Neck reels into Dust Devils? Oh my god, dude. Oh, I'm on the moon. For now, though, it is very late. I haven't eaten dinner, and it is 10.45 p.m., so you bet your ass I'm getting some pizza rolls. Yet another woodcutting level. Can always find time to AFK at the U's. However, I think this might be it for AFKing the trees themselves. For a day or two, I'm going to actually just cut these U logs and get them ready anyway for the fletchings. Each log gives me 75 arrow shafts, and you saw we have like 7,000 in the bank. I will have a lot of fletching banked in the future. I just have to wait for the money to afford the broad arrowheads. Okay, that is like the last thing I expected. 79 fletching from this. I'm getting so little XP. Yeah, I'm getting 25 per log. First session has been going pretty good though. We're uh, almost up to 300,000 arrow shafts. I haven't really done the math yet, but I think to get to 90, I need to get about 350k. So we are almost done with that. Bro, I just started the task. Choke devil. It's not very apparent on these clips, but I am like... I'm pretty sure I'm dry on every single superior from like all the different tasks. So this is a welcome sight. The thing about the smoke devil or the choke devils is that um, <laughs> they have so much HP that it literally takes two rotations to kill it. Um, just a totem. Fair enough. Second one for the task. All right, here's the heart. Thank you. I appreciate it, man. Nah. Jeez, another one. All right, I just looked it up. Choke Devils are 3,000 Slayer each. I should have got like a free 9,000 XP bonus on top of this task already being the best. Love to see it. Brimstone Key. 27 rubies. Not bad. Not usually excited for this task, but I do have an Anguish now. So these Lizard and Shamans are going to be pretty nice. I will be draining Prayer quicker. So that's unfortunate because I'm really low on Prayer Pots. So I'm going to have to like go and make some soon. Uh, but I should be getting at least one max hit, uh, definitely slightly better accuracy, which is real nice because, you know, you don't have range gear here, really. Bro, I, I just got here. <laughs> right, we're we're going to do the clue after the trip. I don't I don't want to leave for it. Oh, oh my god. Dude, we're getting all the drops from hard clues. Yes, dude. That is such a good drop. Such a good drop on an Iron Man. I will never have to drop a fucking heraldic shield step ever again. And there are there's two of them in the game. Now I just need the bucket helm. Unfortunately, that unlocks the agility pyramid step. Fuck that step, but at least I can do it. <laughs> I've had to drop like five clues from it. You can't tell me my character doesn't look sick right now. <laughs> Holy moly, we got another hard clue. Dude, I've just had such great luck this week with these things. Can we make it a third big drop? Sometimes the collection log just baits me. Uh, ancient van braces... Not that important, but we do have a master clue, which is interesting. Oh, I went to the floor because I still do not have a completion. So this could be it. I mean, my account is definitely better than it was before, but I've had to drop every master so far for whatever reason. So hopefully we can maybe do this. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Second step. We got to drop it. <laughs> I have a very good chance of finishing fallows and I just keep failing them. That is the infernal axe. I will not have that for a very long time. No way. No way. Get out. Get out. Grab it. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Oh my god! Holy shit, dude! <laughs> Let's fucking go! Yeah, it's so cheap! 28 mil, what happened to you? What happened to you, my, my beautiful red hammer? Oh, okay. Calm down. Reaction is cringe. We are, we are, we are a normal runescaper, right? We don't, we don't freak out. We don't freak out. I've been, like, literally, I, like, while I've been streaming this, I keep on getting the question of, like, uh, like, shamans on task and stuff like that. And I've always been saying it's just great to do shamans on task because you never know. You might get it on the way, on your Slayer grind, and then, bam, you never grinded for the hammer. And that's what happened for me. So, I don't have to, like, stop what I'm doing to go and get this item later. We are good. So, it's basically just the Slayer shit, and we can get to the higher level content, like Chambers. That is so sick, man. If you're easily annoyed by people's luck, look away. Close your eyes. 684 Lizardman Shamans for this. Boy, that, that's pretty lucky. So um, if you guys forgot, you know, a couple of years ago, my Iron Man got the hammer 
Shit, that was like straight up almost four years ago now. My Iron Man got it at 1306. So even this account beat that one. So two accounts in a row that I've been lucky at the hammer. Just doesn't end, man. Love to see it. Out of all the content that you have to do on an Iron Man, this is definitely one of my top priorities to be lucky, if that makes sense. If I could choose, you know, uh, just because the hammer grind is just generally kind of boring. So I'm really happy we have this done. Now, why am I so happy to have this item? I feel like everyone should know why this item is insanely good on an Iron Man. But in case that you don't, it has such an amazing effect. Its special attack is if I land a hit, I will lower the defense of the enemy by 30%. And that's a percentage reduction. So it is even more effective if the enemy has really high defense. And trust me, this item is insanely good at certain places. Almost a requirement for something like Chambers of Zarek. So lucky to have it this early. Um, it'll also help just in general bossing. Like, this is going to help at God Wars early on. Uh, just doing higher level bosses early on with less gear. A very good example of that is Kelfite Queen. It has pretty high defense, so this uh, hammer can speed up the kills a ton. And again, all you have to do is land a hit. The damage doesn't matter. But it'll be interesting to see like how hard I can hit with this weapon. I know it's very hard hitting. Uh, so I built a combat dummy in the house. I made it undead with an extra black mask that I had from Cave Horrors, and that allows me to get the boost um, as if they're undead with a salve or on Slayer Task with a Slayer Helmet. And we're going to pop the Super Strength. We're going to use the Piety and see how hard we can hit. Here we go. All right, a 76. Oh my god. No kidding. This item is insanely strong if it hits. Oh, and that hit would definitely be even stronger if I had slightly better gear. Like, I don't have a fighter torso, for example. Just haven't gone around to getting it. I, I mainly just do Proselyte Slayer, so I haven't really seen it being useful. But that would definitely increase the max hit a little bit. But anyway, I can't believe I've been lucky on <laughs> both of my Iron Man accounts in a row on this item. It, it's just, it's not fair, man. It's just not fair. And moving forward, I'm just going to keep working on the Slayer grind, as I've been doing in the last few videos. There's so much more work to be done. This is just one piece of the puzzle for the end game gear. If you've been enjoying the series, drop a like, leave a comment. It really does help with the algorithm. I'm getting so close to 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. So if you aren't subscribed, I really would appreciate if you do. I would love to hit 100,000 before the end of the year. And if you don't know about my Twitch, I do live stream over there a lot. So the link is in the description. Come over and say hi. Either way, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.